This is a hardware overview of the ProXR Lite series relay controllers. This particular controller is a four channel controller with a USB interface module installed. This USB interface module may be removed and replaced with many other kinds of technologies. We offer Bluetooth, Wi Fi, Ethernet, Ethernet web page, industrial wireless, RS232, and a few other solutions. This particular video will cover just the hardware aspect of a four channel ProXR Lite controller. This controller has 10 amp relays, which are signified by the Omron relay. We're using the G5LE series. These are very, very high quality relay. We have three contact points per relay. There's a normally open, a common, and a normally closed. And this is repeated th for each of the four relays. There is on this board a ad hoc jumper. This is used for the Wi-Fi module that we have available. There are four LED status lights that indicate the on-off status of each of the four relays. There are eight analog to digital inputs with two grounds. These analog to digital inputs are capable of reading voltages from zero to five volts. These inputs may be used for monitoring sensors. They also have the ability to directly control the relays depending on how you have the controller configured. Here is an up-down jumper. This up-down jumper is used to pull the inputs high or low through a 10K resistor. Uh, one of the rules of analog to digital converters is that you never leave the inputs floating. So this jumper is used to pull these inputs high or low to keep them from floating to reduce noise. This is a temperature sensor output. This temperature sensor output uh, allows you to run a wire to each or any of the A to D inputs. Uh, that will allow you to monitor the onboard temperature sensor just for basic temperature measurement applications. Here we have a 5 volt auxiliary output and a ground. Also we have a 12 volt input which may be used to, to uh, wire a power terminal to this controller so you can wire up your own power supply. This particular uh, uh, video we're using a 2.1 millimeter barrel connector providing 12 volts through this barrel connector. Uh, we also have a program run jumper. The program run jumper is used to set the controller into program or run mode. Um, normally the controller is in run mode, but in program mode, uh, we can use this to configure or to recover settings or that may be incorrect in the controller. A busy ready LED is also included. This busy ready LED indicates the status of the controller. Normally it is ready all the time. However, uh, it will flash to busy as it's processing commands. And the final feature of this controller uh, that we need to explain is that this controller has an unusual shape. This shape is designed to fit into a plastic enclosure. This plastic enclosure is uh, just a general purpose enclosure that you can get uh, from our website. However, uh, you will need to drill out the enclosure for all the connections that you need to make. You can, however, reduce the size of this controller by removing these tabs. There is a total of three tabs. This section is removable, this section through here is removable, and this section is also removable. If you remove these sections, uh, the, the controller will be smaller, but the controller will also no longer be applicable for a return for refund, though we will still warranty it for defects and those sorts of things. Uh, if you have any questions, please send me an email, ryans at controlanything.com. Thank you.